hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel today we're gonna be making vegan protein smoothies and these are really high in vitamin c and the raspberry one is really high in fiber so um we have two recipes that we're gonna do we have the sunshine surprise and berry blast so basically um only the key ingredients are going to change from the two smoothie recipes so these are things that you could really interchange depending on what kind of fruit you have as long as you have the other simple ingredients before we jump in don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel okay so first of all you're going to need a blender of some sort so i have this ninja cup so it's like a personal use blender and for the ingredients, we have cucumber, lime, and you can use a regular size lime. This is a key lime that I had cut in half, but uh, that's just what I have at home. And then we're going to use half of a lemon. So we're going to start by making the sunshine surprise. So half a cucumber, and I'm just going to drop that in. And then we're going to juice this lime, it's key lime. If you do use a regular size lime, I would recommend using half of it first because it might be a little too tart. So just start with half and like work your way up. Okay, so I have my lime in my juicer and I'm just going to juice it and be careful that it doesn't squirt in your eyes <laughs> because that's happened before. Okay, so we're gonna juice the other side. And now I'm taking my lemon, which I realize this is a lime juicer, but every time I try to juice the lemon, somehow it just like catapults out of my hand and just shoots across the kitchen or hits me in the eye. So I'm using the lime juicer. And it's kind of hard, you kind of have to like really wiggle it in, but you know. So we're gonna squeeze our little lemon. Some of it's coming out on the side, but that's fine. And now we're gonna take half a cup of our mango chunk and just kind of eyeball it. Nothing really has to be exact. So half a cup of the mango chunk. And now we're gonna do half a cup of the pineapple. Okay, now we just need to add one cup of water. And if you don't wanna do the cucumber, I just add it in for the extra minerals and vitamins. So I just add that in there to get more in my daily diet. But if you wanna skip the cucumber, you can do, um, another half cup of water so total one and a half cup of water if you want to skip the cucumber portion so we have our one cup of water and now we just have to add the protein so i'm gonna use today the garden of life vegan protein um, I really like this protein because honestly, vegan protein tastes awful, disgusting, kind of like dirt, if you've ever ate dirt before. Oh. Um, so yeah, we're just going to take one scoop of this vegan protein and it is 22 grams of protein. So you might be wondering if you're new to some vegan items, how they get protein when it's not from, you know, an animal source and basically it's just derived from pea protein and like brown rice and stuff like that so yes it is a complete protein source we're just gonna dump that in if it'll come out and now we're ready to blend Okay, so here we have the finished product. It has a little bit of green specks in it. I don't know if you can see it. 
and that's obviously just from the cucumber it would be a lot sweeter i think without the cucumber but i like the kind of healthy taste it gives it but overall yeah it's really good all right moving on to the berry blast smoothie um so basically it's all the same ingredients and you can give or take the half cucumber um if you do skip the cucumber it's just a little more tart but yeah so we're gonna just go through the steps really quick again so we have half cucumber lime juice and this is where it's gonna change up um so we're gonna do half a cup of raspberries and half a cup of blueberries half cup raspberries half cup blueberries one cup of water half a lemon and one scoop of our protein okay now it's ready to blend and here is the finished product oh it is really good I really like this one because it's really really high in fiber so if you were looking to get more fiber in your diet definitely try the berry blast um, I don't know if y'all know this but the serving size on a cup of raspberries is 3 fourths cup which has 9 grams of fiber so since we used half a cup that's probably like 7 grams of fiber and you can play around with the um, ratios of the fruit so if you wanted to do the three-fourths cup, I mean, go for it. It tastes even better like that anyways. So that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed my recipes. And um, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. Um, yeah.